gonna try to find a sim here with some Air Mech Arena. I'm gonna play a three versus three, uh, three, three versus three skirmish. Now, I haven't played this game in a while, but I'm pretty sure I'm still good at it. Um, I want. All right. So basically, your basics are the jet and the helix. Fifty, fifty-one. Um, you can also see like what it's meant for, their transformations. Yeah, sorry if you guys can't see that very well. Hold on. There you guys go. Yeah, that's going to be a little blurry. Wait, here, I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so I cannot do the brightness control. But we are going to play on Nest Nesthorn. Um, my main mech is the Warthog. I am trying to get the... What is this? Yeah, the Pirate Warthog. Looks really sick. The Gothic one looks crazy. The Steampunk just looks weird. But these are actually what they look like inside the game, guys. And the AI so I'll automatically have them. I'll have, uh, I have also have the Osprey. The Neo. That one was the most recent. I also have the Angel, which... If you're femi femi feminine... Sorry, I can't say that right. <clears throat> then this is yours. But if you want to be fast but have a high-powered cannon, this is the one you want. See, um... Uh, Paladin, Angel, um, Saucer, and the war uh, Warthog, and the Bomber. They all have special weapons. The Bomber is a melee. Warthog has a minigun. Saucer has a laser cannon. Two guns. Two guns. Shield and hammer. Other than that, it does shoot with two guns. Two pistols and a high-powered cannon. And this one can also bomb, uh, drop bombs. The ones that can attack the ground units as they are flying would be the Bomber, Warthog, and the Saucer. We are going to go with that. Um, let me check my units. I have the Double Barrel Tank, a Runner, Rockets, Jackal. Hold on, what can I change you out? I'll be back in a sec, guys. All right, I'm back, guys. I was checking out two separate kinds of uh, anti-air mech. Let's see, do I have? Oh my goodness! I have a lot here. It's been a while since I've played. Oh. <laughs> well, I also am playing with Bonaldi. All right, we're gonna play. I turned off all the music and major sound effects. What I'm going to start building is a few of those along with these guys. You may not, you guys may not think it, but trust me, these guys are pretty much worth it. Each air mech can hold up to more than one unit. I just killed him. <laughs> Crud. We're gonna just walk right here. Yeah, okay, you guys see where the indicator's moving? Keep it that way. Keep upgrading that area. Oh! So, you know, honest truth, I can't say Air Mech Arena is a classic game, you know, something I normally play. But, um, it is a very uncommon game. You're, I mean, it's a strategy game, 
where you play as a commander, where you actually get to get into the fight. Now let me show you guys this. This guy. It's called a boxer. These little guys can carry up to a lot of units. They're a good transport. Like, um... There we go. It can carry up to about six units, I believe. Yeah, what am I doing? It's gonna be a waste of time. Let's go fight. Bitch. Or make sure this base is well defended. See, there's three pads over here, right? Crap. Alright, well, we're gonna upgrade our guy. Alright, we're gonna help him with taking the middle place over here.
god. Uh, leave a comment, <clears throat> leave a, doubt, a comment down in the uh, comment section to let me know how much you guys like this game. Uh, and let me know what you guys also think of the game. This is a good strategy game, I think a lot of you should try it. And uh, sorry I haven't really been talking much guys, but uh, okay, so this, what the point of this game is you gotta destroy the objective, which is the enemy base over here. Now, I've won at least two, three online matches, and that's actually all of the matches I've played. And no, I'm not a pro, I just think whoever was playing was a bunch of fucking idiots. Cause, and I mean, it was an easy victory, it took me like six minutes to win. And when you're playing against someone who actually knows what they're doing, it takes a little more than six minutes. I mean, look at this. I'm just coming in here ripping everything up. trouble.
Paladin Quick Charge Core. Nice. Well, you guys can roam around the map after, oh, after you know, something like this has happened. Well, that took not even 20 minutes. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Well, let's see if I unlock the pollen next. And you do have to earn the money, guys. Alright. Well, enjoy. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, guys. I'm going to upload another part. So, yeah, talk to you guys later. Enjoy.